Hi everybody and welcome to my new series of tutorials where I'm going to show you how you can do what I do and capture your screen uh, and the reason I'm doing this is because a lot of people have asked me how I do it and what particular software I use to do it uh, and the software I use is something called Camtasia which is created by TechSmith um, it, it is, uh, you do need to purchase it, uh, but there is a free 30 day trial. So if you want to just test it out, uh, then you can pop on and download it for free. Uh, I'll make sure that the link is in the description below. Uh, it's a fantastic piece of software. I've gone through many, many, many screen recorders in the last couple of years. Uh, and those of you that have been watching since the start will know how uh, terrible my videos were at the start when I was using uh, kind of not very good software. But now I use Camtasia, the quality of the videos is a lot better. Uh, and so click on download link and pop your email address in in order to receive your download trial. It works on both Windows and Mac. So download and then it will come up with a download for here which will then contain Camtasia. So I'm just going to pause this while this downloads. Right guys, so I've now downloaded the Camtasia.exe file uh, and I just need to double click on this and select run. Uh, and it's going to ask me what English, uh, what English, what language I want to be. Uh, and then it's just going to do some crazy install stuff like this. Uh, and I'm expecting it to probably stop working at some point uh, because I've already got it installed um, but it will then come up with this wizard I just want to keep clicking next accept the license agreements uh, choose where you want to install it uh, decide whether or not you want the add-in for Microsoft PowerPoint uh, I don't use it with PowerPoint so I'm not going to install that add-in uh, and then whether or not you want to create a shortcut uh, and then click next and it will run the installation for you uh, I'm actually going to exit the setup however because I've already got it installed and I'm actually using it to record this video right now and that is going to be it for this tutorial in the next tutorial I'm going to show you how to start using your software and record your screen so thanks for listening and I hope to catch you then